But Chris, I know we, you know we've talked about a lot of different things today. What would you like to just share with our audience as a takeaway to help them manage their emotions and uh, come away with more power and more focus based on that? Okay, I want to <clears throat> I want to make a couple of points, and obviously this is from my perspective, my my vantage point, my viewpoint, my eyes. Um, self emotional intelligence EQ. Uh, I want to just share a couple of the main components of it to begin with. And it's steeped in four, in my mind, and, and you can read this. So it's not just my mind. Uh, it's steeped in self-awareness, self-regulation, social awareness, and relationship management. Those are the four key pillars there. Um, I keep going back to the title, how to master your emotions. Now, if I'm using me as my own model, which is the only model I have to begin with, it's, you know, charity begins at home. Okay, let's begin. Charity begins at home. So for me, it's I went from the person that case of or whatever happens, happens to I'm, I started to make the investment in learning how to manage my emotions. And now I'm moving into this to the phase where I'm learning how to master my emotions. So it's a process. You just don't wake up in the seat. And I think that's called giving yourself a chance. A, it's a it's a recognition piece. You a you start first you gotta identify and be able to recognize it and be able to be honest about it. Uh, good shortcomings, good points. I do this well, I do this poorly put it all out on the table and, and try to make some sense of it all at that point. I, and, it, and you don't do that on your own. You, if, you know, if you, you know, it's like, I always say, I don't work on my own teeth. There's a professional to help you out. There's someone that can help you out, whether it's a friend, whether it's a, you know, a, a professional relationship, you have a therapist, whatever, you, however you choose to try to attack what you know is not right. So that's the other thing. Um, my final thoughts are, I'm going to ask a basically a rhetorical question.